When you come to reload the Angus super boiler, it is ideal to blow through the wood gases. When the boiler is on tick over, the self-modulating fan will blow through the wood gases on a five minute interval for 20 seconds on factory settings. It is possible that when you come to reload the boiler, it may be just before it's about to blow through the wood gases. Hence, it is advisable to put the boiler into gasification mode to blow through the wood gases before reloading. After about 30 seconds, this will have blown through all the wood gases. You can then disarm the self-modulating fan, chimney flap open, and open the loading chamber door. Before reloading, make sure you have a good ember layer and use the riddle to make sure that there is an even spacing of the embers. Fill the loading chamber with seasoned wood, 15 to 20% humidity. Ideally, these are situated like bullets in the magazine of a rifle. Laid lengthways, one on top of the other. It is an ideal situation to fill the loading chamber up completely as this will aid the pyrolysis process. In this particular example, there is some smoke exiting the loading chamber door as this particular working demonstration does not have a chimney fan. Usually most customers will have a chimney fan and at this stage they would switch on the chimney fan to suck the wood gases up the flue. When you have loaded, shut the loading chamber door, shut the chimney flap, rearm the self-modulating fan and if you had a chimney fan you would then turn the chimney fan off. Use small pieces of wood, off cuts, typically these are from a joinery shop, they need to be dry but it's to be noted that also wood that has nails or screws or coach bolts is not an issue with the wood gasification log boiler. Once you've used the kindling and started a fire, you would use fully seasoned logs, 15 to 20% humidity, and stack them lengthways. It is possible when you have built up a fire in the loading chamber, that if you have sawdust, you can place this on top of the logs. Also, if you have any wood shavings, these can be placed on top as well to make sure that you use all your waste wood product.